the Bulls receive Daniel Tice, but he's not active tonight. He's not with the team. A little bit of one, two, two. Uh, Kobe, Kobe White is one you got to get to. The way the game is played now, that you leave too many opportunities to get to the paint, either a shot or make the play. How many NCAA teams have lost only one game since Indiana's undefeated season in 1976? We were going through it. Five teams. Wait, what about, uh, oh, St. Joe's? Thad Young. I got, a, I got a voice from the inside to sit. Martin nearly had it, but White has it with five to shoot. He can shoot with range. Yeah, he, they, that's why they put him in that role, Chris, because he was playing point guard. Got to try to speed him up. Aaron Holiday gets inside, blocked by Markinen. Bulls leading the break with Young. White to give Chicago a nine-point lead. That's what he does. Brown yeah. short, but a long rebound out for the Bulls. They have out rebounded the Pacers 17 to seven. And White. Chris said, I said to you, to your point, I said to you, the last time the Pacers played the Bulls, I said they were better. I said they're much better this time. Because what they were able to figure out, they've got a little bit more scoring ability and size on the floor. You gotta watch him, because he's feeling. Thank you. Chris. Yeah. yeah. 320 to go. Kobe White back in. Over to Vucevic. Hits a oh, three. Three goal up. Pacers by two games, but that's why this game is so big. Yeah. Because whoever wins it has the tiebreaker. Sumner has to put up a tough shot and is fouled by Kobe White. Upset Otherwise, the Pacers have to chase guys. Oh, he, he got held. Yeah, he got held. No question. One of those guys I really respect in this league. We all love Thad, but, you know, the last couple times we've right. seen the Bulls, we haven't loved him so much those nights. No doubt about it. What Thad does is tell you the truth. And he was able to catch his balance. And Edmund Sumner back to the free throw line. You know, the Pacers have had trouble against Chicago's half-court defense, so you like to see Ed. Good defense thus far, halfway through the clock. Williams. That's because of Vucevic. It's just been it's really tough. This is good for Goga. Vucevic again. White in transition for three. You're talking about an effervescent light. Did they throw that off of Goga? Well, first of all, this is, I told Chris before the game, there was a different team the Pacers played the last game, and this is a better team than yeah. that one. Lamb was trying to get the rebound, looked at the official, no foul. Well, because Troy Brown Jr. gave him a little hip check. That's why Lamb couldn't control it. White and a 20-point lead. Second time tonight. Ten straight to start the fourth quarter for the Pacers. Markinen trying to change that and does. Kobe White actually made the play. That's a warm-up shot he had. He just looks way more comfortable, Quinn, coming off the bench, Markinen. I agree. Boy, that, that sure looked like there was a hand on the ball when it was on the rim. Well, I, it, it could have been in the cylinder. I don't know if it was on the rim. White. Oh. And they come. I mean, this is just not anything Chicago has had the last few years. Oh, you think you thought I was kidding when I said they're better, <laughs> didn't you? I told you this is a different team. team. That was the night. It was a triple double for Westbrook. They scored 132 points. White stumbling and bumbling down the lane. That's well said, partner, because that's all that was. 